Hello, welcome to the channel. And today we have Leap Code 766, Toplet Matrix. So given the damn time and matrix, we turn true if the metric is topless, otherwise we turn false. The topless is, topless matrix is mean like from the top to the right bottom, this uh, dark node line is all having the same number. So we have two here, three here, five here. It's pretty straightforward. And uh, now you can see this all uh, fulfill the requirement. So in this matrix, so we return true. But in here, the diagonal line, which doesn't contain the same number, then we turn false. First of all, when you solve this problem, um, what we will do is, as a person, we we'll look at the first number here and then go down like this. And if we look at the second number, go down like this. And just keep doing everything from here to make sure everything looks good. But to the computer code, that's kind of complicated to go down like this with this pattern. Um, now we have to think of a solution that we only go to this area right here. We don't need to care about the edges, the top and the lap edges. Go from here to all the way to the bottom, right? So if this number, same as the previous lab top, and that we can move forward. We check this one, the same as this. It's three is same as this. It's five, same as five, and here we align to this line. So that's the idea of this question. After checking everything up here, and then if we see nothing is wrong, and then we turn true, that's it. So to the code, we know how to write a um, for loop, double for loop to loop through every of this character here. So now we start from zero, zero is right here. And I will write the for loop for everything first. I is less than matrix dot length I plus plus. Y is equal to zero. Y is less than matrix dot um. So this is double for loop for looping everything. So let's start from zero, zero, and then the lane go one by one. But in here, we start from this corner here, we go from one and one. So we start from one, row one, row two, all the way down, and then column one, column two, all the way to the DN. So the first one is gonna be one, one, row one and column one. So now we know this is the area we're looking for. We need to check if matrix I, Y, so which is this number here, is not equal to matrix I minus one, Y minus one. So if they're not, so this is current, I mean, integer. So compared to the top that one, which is minus one, minus one here, if they're not the same, we turn false. And now we're checking every of the location here. After the whole for loop, if we don't see any false, we just return true. That's the answer. The reason why I don't do the edge case is because I can assume uh, the matrix is within the same uh, it has the right lane. So you see M and N is within the right range. So we don't need to do the um, checking here. So that's it for these questions. Now it's all true, submitted, and it beats 100%. And that's it. And if you have any question, comment below, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.